Ladies and gentlemen, this is Bunny Says. I'd like to welcome you back to another edition of Minecraft. Now, we're back here at the pier. And if you notice, that I'll show you a couple little things I did while I was off uh, off camera. Uh, one thing I did was I... Uh, I went back to town. I had to get more food. In a few moments, I had more food. Uh, I was running out, so I ran back to town, and I brought a bunch of stuff back um, to town. Uh, to my home, my house, my base, and I brought it back a couple of trees. I thought I'd put a couple of acacia trees there to make it look like. I said, no, nah, the acacia trees are sort of like olive trees. They're like survival, right? I mean, they're like civilization. So I made a little square there in the water and put a little tree on it, and I put one down there, and hopefully they'll grow. Uh, and I put one over there. That one grew immediately the second I put it down. Now if you'll notice a couple of chests are missing, that's because, and I think this one's this one empty? No, okay. Uh, that's because I took all the, uh, I started uh, making a preliminary move. I started dragging all the stuff back, you know, <laughs> to town. And that took a while. I got run by three or four times. Uh, but I have so basically what I have left is a little bit of dirt, some of the odds and ends, some stone, just some building materials, and some uh, cobblestone. Oh, and I got the, the main thing was, is I ran off and got the, um, I, and I moved down the chest, the empty chest, one now, one down there, and got one there. Uh, the main thing I did was, was I, Got a bunch of the clay bricks and I um, fired them all. Got a bunch of clay and fired them all into bricks. And I brought back some from back from town. So that was the main deal. Uh, and after that, I moved the stairway stairway back one more one more step. And I made a little. What did I do up here? Oh, I I uh, planted another acacia tree there. That one was already there, and I think I plant one over here too. Back there, I'm gonna plant. Oh yeah, I plant one back there. I just, you know, I just ran around planting a few of them. Uh, I guess the main thing is, is that I got the bricks and I flattened out a little platform area here. I made a little platform because I was thinking of building a little boathouse, a little dock house here that I. And put a little bed in there. That's why I put the chest there. And I figured it'd be a little place to sleep if you have, if I have a, coming up in the boat and it's late at night or something like that. Like that, I could just pull up here and jump into the house and go to sleep. That's all. And I thought about putting one. I'm gonna put one up here too. I think someplace over here. What I will do is I build a bridge going from here to there. I like just a walkway. But, uh, yeah, I'll put, maybe I'll put one up over here or something, a little house over here, or maybe over here, a small house or something here, just a little place to sleep, so when you pull up, you quickly jump into it, if it's nighttime and I want to hurry up and sleep, I could just jump into the bed and go to sleep, that's all it is, and that's all I'm going to do, I'm not going to waste a lot of time on it. But, uh, okay, I made the bricks, so, I mean, I made the things so I can make the bricks. That should be plenty, I think. I mean, I'm, I may have run a little overboard, but whatever. Uh, okay, I need the stairs, that's what I needed. Because, yeah, that'll be like 40 stairs, okay. Okay, let me do this. For right now, I'll do that for right now. That should be plenty of stairs. I mean, it's 84 stairs. That should be plenty. Okay, let me get rid of this here. Oh, you know what? I'll do this. There. Wait a minute. Didn't I already have 84? Okay, now it's 88. Okay. All right, let's put the stairways down. Yeah, let me, okay. 
actually, I don't know. That's a lot of, that's a pretty big area. So maybe I might end up using a lot of these. Okay, just put them down real fast. Oops. Oops. It's okay. Oh, wow. There might be a lot, of, not, a lot not as much as I thought. I might need actually more, now that I think about it. Uh, okay. Let's see here. Yeah, I'm, you know what, I think I'm going to need more. Because these are going to run out. Yeah, they, yeah, absolutely. I'm pretty sure I'm going to need more. Yeah, this tends to, okay, yeah, that's, well, okay. Well, yeah, that's not even half, <laughs> okay. Well, all right. I might not, I might have correctly guessed that I needed this many. Wow, I don't, I might have to go, wow. I might actually have to go get more, I, I don't know. See here. Hopefully that's enough. That should be enough. I mean, that should be. Well, I don't know. Might not be. Um, okay. Well, I'm gonna have to run off and grab some more clay. That's really surprising to me. I thought I had plenty. I expected to have some left over, two or three stacks left over, so I could use to bring back home. Okay, but I guess not. What the? <laughs> it's always that one thing screwing up. Screwing everything up. Okay. Alright, why are they? Yeah, because I don't think that's, yeah, that's not going to be enough there. I don't believe it will. It'll just be almost enough. Yeah. Yeah, that's, yeah, okay, yep. Oh, you know what? I'm wondering, too, if, uh, let me see something here. Yeah, I want to get the edges like that. The corner off the edges, just to make it look nice, you know. See what this does. Okay, this should be, and I might, and like I was saying, I might want to use some. Uh, no, okay, yeah, that's not right. Yeah, I was thinking, I'll be, I'll be using wood for the platform. So, okay, yeah, that's right. All right, so let's check this out. I'll probably need another. 30 more stairs, maybe, I, I, I guess I'm going to need another four stacks of clay. Uh, the reason I mainly did it offline is because it takes a while to bake them, bake the clay into bricks. You know, you have to sit there and wait for them to bake. But, no oh well. 13. Okay. Let me fix this one here. Yeah, because uh, yeah, cause I'll make the platforms coming out of wood. I'll make that, like I said, I'll make a wood platform here. And then I wonder, when, I wonder what color wood I should use. Dark wood? No, I want to use something like, oh, uh, what happened to that? Uh, some kind of reddish wood, maybe the, oh, why is it doing that, that's, okay, oh, there you go, okay, um, I'm not sure, I don't want to use spruce, that's a little too brown, I think, maybe, I, actually, I don't know, let me think about it, um, uh, what kind of color 
Wood. Uh, let me see. I have some wood left over? No, I don't. Oh, that's because I was... Oh, yeah, that's because I was like, oh, yeah, there's trees here. I could just grab them and cut them down for wood. Uh, I was thinking something like that kind of wood. The acacia wood. That sort of reddish... Uh, a red wood. Okay. Anyway, let me get out and let's uh, go grab some. Uh, <laughs> what's the name? Some of the clay. Oh yeah, I sliced off some of the thing here just to make it a little open, more open. This this thing come all, all the way over to here. I just cut it all down just to make the pathway a little more open. Now I'm wondering if I use my fortune axe, does it? Do I get extra clay? I didn't, you know, I never did check that. No, I don't. Okay. And I took clay from all over this area and everywhere close by. That means I'm going to have to find more clay. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, I wonder if I could see it on the map. Getting close to it. No. Okay. Guess not. I was, uh, I, I went to here. I was cut up all the clay here. So, let's, uh, let's look. Yeah, because I was around the corner. See over here, there's a hole. And it's only a tiny little bit. I was, I came around and was cutting up to over here. literally grabbing clay from almost anywhere because each one of these is four clay so think of it like that and this and the stacks are usually only small uh, I mean the spots are usually you know small spots of seven or eight clay or something like that you know okay Okay, get out of here. It's good. You're on my way. See, this this is one of the things you need uh, if you have the. Yeah, okay, yeah, I got it off from here. I remember. Um, this is one of the reasons why you need the respiration on your helmet, or um, and you like the aqua infinity, uh, aqua affinity, you know that type of thing, so you can see underwater. It actually, one of them, either Depth Strider or Aqua Affinity, allows you to see underwater better. So it's lighter. So you can actually see what's going on. If you play without it, you'll notice it's very dark underwater. And you have a hard time seeing, really. Unless, of course, you turn the brightness up and stuff. I have not. And uh, Now this may look a little dark in the video. I don't know how dark it look in the video, but I could see pretty clearly from here. It's not, it's not bright or anything, but I could see it pretty well. Enough to be able to tell what clay is and what's, um, you know, what's that uh, uh, rubble there, whatever it is, the flint things. Okay. Uh, Get some air, come back down. A few blocks of, uh, what are these called again? Gravel. Oh, yeah. Gravel. Okay. Okay, now I'll need four stacks of, uh, of this stuff. It's clay, so. Okay. I mean, it shouldn't be too hard to get it. Yeah, I mean, it's not a problem getting a hold of clay. It's just getting a nearby source of clay, you know. Uh, let's see, I already have four, almost four stacks already. I'll grab, I'll, you know, I'll grab six just in case. Oh, wow, what's that down here? Is it a hole in the ground? Is it? Oh, wow. Well, look at that. Is that? Oh, well, wow. look at that. There's a, oh, there's a whole dungeon down there. What do you know? I love it when you come into water and it's like a dungeon down there. 
so cool. It's like I, it's like I found Atlantis or something. You know, it's really cool. To me, it's sort of uh, I love it. Look, look, there's a little. Uh, there's a monster here. All right, you, back off. Oh, water coming through. Time to get out of here. It also makes for a little uh, areas where you could stick torches and breathe. Is there another hole over there too? Wow. There is. I can see red stuff behind it. Oh, wow. That's so cool. Uh-oh. Ah, one well, of the things broke and fell down. All the sand. Let me, let me dig down there and get rid of all the sand and move it. I just want to see the space here. See, if you'll notice my breath, my level of breath, it takes a while. If you have respiration three, you can breathe on the water for a good while. Oh, well, okay. It's not a big hole, it's just a very small one, but it's cool enough. Any more? Is there another one over here? No, okay. Let's get some more, um... Man, is there more clay around? There's a little bit over there. I might have, you don't find too much clay in the ocean. You generally find it in rivers. But I don't have any rivers close by. I mean, it, this is obviously closer. Yeah, here we go. Here's a big spot of it. Okay, good. Also, I think you find clay in swamps a lot of the time. You find big spots like this in swamps. Or I've always found them a little, a little easier in swamps. I think it's basically supposed to be like shallow water. Whatever you have an area of shallow water, basically. Which would make sense, you know, it's clay, right? So. Oh my god, my breath. This is the problem with the uh, respiration on your thing, too. You don't. You, you, you can be underwater for so long, you don't, you're not really paying attention to your breath after a while. <laughs> okay, let me see how much. Uh, three, four, five. Three, four, five, six. Okay, there we go. I'll finish up the last. I might as well make it eight, I guess. Since I'm near some spots here. Okay. The little suction you get in the water now. Didn't you? It wasn't there before. It wasn't always there. There's a little pull forward when you uh, break a block. There's a little sort of suction, a little attraction that pulls you towards blocks and stuff that sort of keeps you on the ground. It sort of slows you down a tiny bit. Okay, let me see here. Yeah. Three, four, five, six, seven. When this one fills up, that'll be it. Also, I don't want to cook them all day, too, so. Fifty-two. Maybe fifty-six. Sixty. One more. Perfect. So, which is one more block anyway? Ah, there we go. That's good. I'll leave this whole thing there. This whole mess. Uh, and... Maybe remember where this is, so I come back if I need to. Ah, there it grew. Okay. Yeah, perfect. Acacia tree grew. Look. 
that's exactly what I wanted. It's supposed to be mocking, like, it'll be like the equivalent of like an olive tree or something like that, like that in ancient Greece or something, right? You know, mock civilization, you know, basically like that. That's all. I think I'm going to start using those trees as supposed to be my marker for civilization. And that's a little squad one. I sort of like that, actually. Uh, okay. Let me cook these up. Maybe you hold the shift key and it will move the whole stack. Uh... Did I have stone over here? Yes, I did. Okay. I left this here just as building materials. That's all. Uh, and where do I get the mushrooms? I don't, know, don't remember, but okay. Uh, let me just move these. Stuff back. There we go. A little moon rising up. That looks pretty good. It's also another reason why I situated this area, this pier, because I like the way it, the moon, you know, rises in the east and then the sun rises, it sets in the west. It, you know, it's perfect it's facing the exact west, the exact east. You know. In the meantime, I'll have to wait for those to cook. Uh, what could I do? Oh yeah, I mean, you know what? I'll start chopping down some trees and getting some wood. Uh, do I have a... I have an axe here. Okay, yep, I have it on me. I'll make another axe. Might as well make a quick one. I think I can chop down a whole bunch of wood. Okay. And I'll run back here and start chopping down some... I don't know, you know what? I'm gonna... hold on, hold on, let me run back to town for a minute. Oh, I'll bring some stuff with me. Any kind of junk I have with me. This is just cobblestone. Uh, I'll bring back a few extra... I will need, need sand. Oh, the mushrooms. Okay, there we go. Since I'm on a sort of run here, I might as well move some more stuff. And I was thinking, I was looking at this area here. I need to put some dirt down there. I need to level that off. This area too, make a little, make a little stairway going up. Level all this stuff off, make it look nice. Which I think I'll do. If I'm waiting for that stuff to cook still, I'll I'll grab some dirt and start leveling that, that, that stuff off. Okay, now not spruce and not a dark wood, but maybe jungle, either jungle or acacia wood. Let me take a look at the two of them. Okay. Come back home. What do I have in here? Okay, some extra cobblestone. And now, oh yeah, I put it in the acacia tree there. Thinking that maybe if I get it to grow up and sort of hook this way, it'll look sort of cool. So I cut down the oak tree there and stick the acacia tree up. <laughs> That's all. Oh, while I was doing stuff, I did rearrange. I made this extra box here. And one in front of the, the uh, oh, you know what? I'll start cooking these up right here. I threw all the extra iron in there to let them cook. Uh, this is just to hold coal and some food. And I rearranged some stuff so that it would, I would only have to need one extra box. I had to actually put up another box and then use it as a place to move stuff around, you know. This is just all stone, all earth. This is all miscellaneous, you know, the uh, diorite, granite, andesite, that type of stuff. This is the usual. 
place I always had it. And these three are pretty much the same. It's this is the same as dying wood. Now this I moved from uh, I moved a little bit of the I moved the colored glass here and some stuff, some miscellaneous stuff here. And I put all that stuff that was over there over here. This all fit together. I was like, this all fits about right. It looks right, you know. Let me do this. Make some blocks out of this real fast. Okay, let me do that. Uh, some. Where did I put the gravel? Yep, okay. Sand? Okay, let me get 13. There's some extra stone. What am I going to do with that? Um, it won't fit there. I'll just stick it in the bottom here. I don't, I don't care. Let's throw those away. Uh, now let me look at the wood here. Yeah, this is too dark. This to me looks too dark. I don't like that. I wanted this color, but it is acacia wood. Okay. Or the jungle wood, I guess. No. Let me throw those down. Let me throw them both down. A couple of pieces of each. Yeah, okay. Hmm. The jungle wood would certainly be easier, but I like the redness of the acacia wood. You know what? I'll actually use the jungle wood, this wood here. Because I don't want it to be too bright. The acacia wood looks a little too bright, I think. And this gives it more of a faded look. This wood looks like faded acacia wood, and I would imagine in a pier, would, you know, the uh, the you know the salt, the air, and just everything would, you know, m make the wood not only rot, but but it would you know make it start falling apart a little bit and dull its color, you know. So good, okay, we use uh, jungle wood. That's easy enough, I got a whole stack of it there. It's easy to get a hold of jungle wood because uh, of the giant jungle trees I have. <laughs> okay, let me do this. I'll throw these two away and that's it. Uh, let me get another pickaxe here. There we go. That'll be easy, all right, that's good. Um, okay, I guess I won't need these axes after all. Uh, it doesn't matter. And I'll f finish, what I'll do is I'll make the boat houses next time. And I'll do some of the landscaping with the dirt. And, um... Uh, and put up the, the pier with the wood. Yeah, I was thinking... How does this look again? Oh yeah, okay. I was thinking of making the railroad go straight, a branch off the railroad that'll go straight to the pier. We'll go, just go up along here. And just go straight through. I guess it'll go straight through what here, and then that'll be... Oh yeah, it'll be here. Maybe I'll just... Do that. Or maybe I'll just slice part of that wall off. Just have it go straight along here. Go. Why? Why make it go around when I can slice the entire mountain down? Just go along here. <laughs> yeah, it'll go straight right there. Yeah. Oh, actually, I want to do want it to go to the side, so maybe I will angle it and have it stop here. I'll have it stop like right here or something. So maybe I will make it angle a little bit. All right. I'm, okay. Good. Let's see how far our stuff is baking. Almost, okay, it's only halfway done. Whatever, I still have the wood to do work with right now. And I make a little boathouse, I make it out of wood too. I'm gonna make it a nice little, maybe like a stone, a brick base, and then make the rest wood. So let me do this. I think I'll need this much uh, wood. I'm going to make the base come out to, I'll have it start here. So 
So let's do that. Yeah, that's a much better choice, I think. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that looks good. That's a good choice, I think. Okay, there we go. And I'm going to cut down some of this stone here. This stuff, this stuff jetting out. I'll cut down. I'll just have it go across there like that, that's all. Okay. And, um, yeah, I'll just fill this up with, oop. Okay, I knew I was going to do that. Always happens to me. up that quick. Okay, I hope not. <laughs> oh, I was going to make some supports out of wood. Maybe not. <laughs> I'll make a lot of work. Uh, I'll make the base. Okay. Uh, out of brick and then make the rest of it out of wood. Okay. Maybe I should make one more square right now. Okay, no, that's it. Get rid of this thing here. There. And, uh,. Oops, no, oh, where are my torches? A couple torches here. I think it looks sort of cool. Torch there. Well, how many squares is that away? One, three, four, five, fifth square. Okay. Five squares, uh, two, three, four, fifth square. There we go. Didn't want it to be an even. I could throw it on my bed finally, <laughs> on the pier. Actually, I might take one of the. I might take one square of wood. I might take one. You know what? Yeah, I'm going to take one line of wood off. Oh, you know what? Now I could use the axe. Well, oh, okay. The water's going to be like that, huh? All right. Because that's too far out, because I'm going to make the piers go out, so... Um, and I don't want this walkway taking up too much space. That's perfect. It comes up to the wall. Yeah, that's perfect. Okay. Okay. I think I'm going to need the bucket. Yeah, I think I will. <laughs> I can see how the bricks are doing. Okay, good. I now I have more wood than I thought I uh, would need. Okay. Yeah, almost done. Okay, good. All right. Just there we go. Perfect. Now this is what I thought I could do with the other place and the other tunnel there. I thought I could just do that and it would fix right up. 
you know. Okay. Now, how am I going to make these piers? I guess... Well, I guess... Okay. Well, I'll, I'll make two or three or... So I'll make three. Okay, let me do this. Uh, starting here, I guess. So I'll make them two wide. Okay, I guess that's... That, that's too far out, isn't it? Is it all, I mean, I don't want the boat coming up and... And I think it's too... Close to the wall. So I'm gonna do this and then... Okay, I have the axe right there, why did I do that? Okay, yep, I'm gonna do this. to be this far out. Yeah, I guess it's far out. One, two, three, eight, nine. Yeah. Actually, maybe one less. Eight, I guess. Yeah, I guess, yeah, because it comes out to the light. No, you know what? I'm going to make it, I am going to make it nine. There. Okay, let me grab these squares real quick. I'll need these. And I'll make three, the equivalent of three pairs, supposedly sticking out. Okay. Um, one here, I guess, and one more. How many squares is that in between? Two, three, four. Yeah, one, two, three, four. Yep. Okay. Right here, be right there. Okay, yeah, that's right. Okay, yeah, that's good. Perfect. That's a good idea, right? That's good. Okay, one more. There we go. I should have enough wood, I think. All right, yep. I'll have plenty for that. Okay, let me get in here. There should be plenty of enough wood here. Okay, one more. All right, okay, yep. That's it. That would be three pairs sticking out. Yep. Okay, that's cool. Uh, maybe I should make make two pairs and leave the space open. Three, three square pairs. Yeah, you know what? I think I will do that. No, I like the extra space open. I'll make the pairs that are there a little bigger. It's taking forever. Man, the axes still don't chop down no <laughs> wood that fast. Unless you have a nice efficiency axe. Okay, where's the other pieces? Yeah, here they are. Okay, that's it. And, uh, yeah, what I'll do is. Yeah, okay, that's it. I'll make it three squares wide here like this. And I'll move this pier over, actually. It'll be three squares like this. I'll slice off the end there. Okay. Uh,
and by this time all that stuff should be cooked and that'll be perfect okay good timing oh, is there any more wood down here yes there is okay <clears throat> now I missed a couple of squares there of wood that's all right Actually, I don't know if this is, uh, I don't know if I should make the pairs two squares wide. Well, I mean, three squares wide. I don't know if I... I'm going to actually slice off more, you know what? I will make it three squares wide, but I'm going to make it, uh, one, one more square over. I wonder if there's a way to help out swim. I guess. I guess you could swim down, but you're sort of swimming down and forward. I was wondering if there's a way to make yourself go down faster, like dive faster. Could I press like the C key to go down faster that way? Let me see here. Hold on. Let me check this out. It's not fast in the way. No, it doesn't make any difference. I was thinking the. Uh, the duck key would make you go faster, but no, it doesn't. There we go. Um, I will make them a square longer. Should I? Yeah, because it matches the lighthouse. Okay. There we go. Alright, that's it. That's fine. That looks good to me. Let me put the wood away. From a, oh, why, why should I put it away? I'll just put it in my inventory. I have plenty of space. Uh, okay. Let me go get the clay, make the stairs. And I guess that'll be it for this episode. I mean, really, wow, that went by real fast. Uh, faster than I thought. Okay, yeah, the clay's done. Okay. And this should be enough. This should be plenty. I'll have 40 squares there. Of, yeah, oh, yep, that'll be plenty. Okay. Let me get the corners first. You know. Okay, it's not... Okay. I think it'll be plenty. I, it should be. Okay, maybe... Okay, maybe... Few, maybe not. I, I don't know. Wow. Okay, I'm not even sure if this will be enough. Uh... I think this should be enough here. Yeah, I saw that 13. So did you. Oh, wow. Am I going to be just one? Wow, it'll be just enough. Oh my god, wow. That's it, wow. Okay. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> I guess that was uh, just enough there. Let me grab some dirt and do some of the landscaping as I run back and get the clay from the other place. Uh, and I'll quickly do some. Yeah, I just have enough for nine block. I might want to use some brick to. Uh, like I said, I might want to do the foundation of the boathouse with brick. I might build a bridge straight over this. I'll make a, uh, a separate stairway there or something because that stupid hole is right in the middle of me running. Wherever, whenever I run back and forth, it's always right in that spot. Okay. 
Okay, this one, there we go. Worked. Um, there we go. There we go. Oop, wrong ones. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's cool. Yeah, okay. And like that. There we go. Get rid of this. In this corner. Put that there. Like that. Uh, yep, like that, definitely. There we go. That, yep, okay. There we go. Yep. And like that. There we go. And cornered all that off. Actually, you know what? I'll corner this off. Uh, yeah. No, okay, you know what, no, okay. Like that, that's all. I'll do like that, okay, that's it. Yep, like that, perfect, there we go. Yep. No, I have that there. I go there, okay. Couple of nice little spots over here. There we go. And a little dirt work way down there. Like that. Okay. There we go. I'm very thorough when I do these <laughs> things. Okay. And there, there. Put that there. Nice little corners here. I'll go like this. Yeah, okay, that's it. Yep. That'll look nice. Fix that. Okay, let's head back now. And yeah, I think I will. Uh, I'll make the railroad go over here. I'll make a. And I'll. Yeah, okay, that's it. I make a line going straight here, straight through. And I'll have to move this tree. And I will slice down part of that mountain. I'll go like this. And then I'll move that tree back a couple of squares. So it doesn't interfere. Actually, I might as well cut it down now, I guess. I have the axe with me. Yeah, it's a little too close to the other tree anyway, so. That's my excuse, I'm sticking to it. Uh, that's perfect. I can put this. Uh, Okay, yeah, I'll stick this here, like that. Get rid of this junk, it's in the way. At least some of it. Real quick. I just want to see where the other trees, I want a clear impression of where the other tree is going to grow. If I need to move a bit further back or whatever. Or if I should, even should put it there. Maybe I won't even... Okay, let me see. Oh yeah, okay, that's fine. That's far enough away. And that should go there like that. Okay. And then it will come along here. And I'll slice down that 
Actually, maybe I'll select on two slots there, so I won't be slapping up against the side of the. Oh, actually, you know what? I said I was going to angle. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh well. Move the whole tree for nothing. <laughs> okay. And it's just a quick way, so I could, if I need to go to the pier, I can go back and forth. I don't have to do this run, this long run. Let me have one of the railroad all the way over to here. Eh, actually, I, no, I don't want to do that because I don't want to mess around with my fields. They look bad. Oh, it grew. See, see that? As you come in, I. Oh, I also moved the home spot over a tiny bit. Because when I was coming through, you would, would block the view. But look, this comes up perfect. Look at that. Come through there, and it's the shape of the tree and everything. Look. You go there and you see the tree growing. Oh, wow. Yeah, look at that. I'm going to go right up against the wall, huh? I'll go forward to backward, huh? That's weird. I thought it was going to go side to side, but... I'll, you know what? I'll leave that there. That's sort of cool. I wish it grew the other direction, towards facing frontwards, but... That's cool. I'll leave that. See, that's my civilization tree. That's my acacia tree. Look, it almost fits the thing, you know? Fits the form of the mold here. Ah, that's perfect. I okay. I'll I'll stick with that. That's good. Let's see. Where did I? No, oh, here they are. Uh, it goes here. Oh no! Give me that jungle wood back. Uh, what, what do they need? More dirt? Is uh, what? Oh, it's growing the clay. What am I doing? Let me get rid of some of that stuff here. Okay, I'm going to grab the clay, I'm going to head back, and that's, I'm going to call that for a file, because uh, we're already, we're already uh, past 50 minutes, so, we head back to the pier, and then I'll end it when I get back there, that's it, so yeah, because I'll make the railroad go on here. Yeah, I'll come along here, straight along here. I'll go up a line, go up one more. Or maybe actually I'll dig one more down, because I'm just going to have to come back down again. So yeah, maybe I'll just dig both those things down. Leave a bottom line of stone, because I'm going to... Yeah, because I'll have to go up to... Right, so... And I'll angle it, so it comes over to here and like stops here or something. Like right here, like right here. You know, let me put a block there. So the railroad will come over here, and you know, that's all. So, okay, I have my clay. Can I do it? Yeah, I can do it from here. Okay, that's it. Perfect. There, I got my clay bricks. So next time, I'm going to. I have the pier. How's the pier looking? Good. Looks good to me. Enough space on this side. Enough space for these two. Enough space here. And maybe I'll put some kind of little tower here or something. Little, yeah, yeah, I don't know. Whatever. But I'm going to make a little boathouse over the side here. That's what I'll do next time. So, okay. This bunny says, uh, thank you for joining me. And I'll say goodbye for now. And it's slowly getting done piece by piece. Uh, a little bit at a time. And look at that sun going down. And you can see the tree in the background. Look, you can still see the lava a little bit. And the acacia tree growing right there in the middle. I think it looks great. Let me get up, let me get a view up top. Let me get a nice view of the setting sun. Here we go. Like you can see the, oh, that's, that's one grew too. Good, perfect. Look, you know, the tree there growing. You can see the tunnel way off in the background, the lava coming down, the waterfall, the crazy waterfall on the floating island, <laughs> and the tree. All right, so thank you for joining me. I'll say goodbye for now, and uh, hopefully, hopefully you'll join me again. So goodbye.